Google coming in, into Adelaide really demonstrates that we are world leaders in artificial intelligence. Google are attracted by that capability. They're attracted by how that capability can work in different industry sectors. AWS highlighted that some of the largest technology companies in the world are, are picking South Australia to open offices in to do innovation and to really push the AI data analytics capability of those you know, world leading companies. The combination of having the Australian Institute of Machine Learning and the MIT Big Data Living Lab in South Australia really made something quite unique that you're not really getting anywhere else in the world. The Australian Institute of Machine Learning is a top 10 research institute in the world for AI and when it comes to things like robotic vision it's top two in the world. Also the MIT Big Data Living Lab is here in Adelaide is unique as well because it, it was really Bank SA um, and uh, Optus and DSpark, um, sort of large telco uh, and their data analytics capability and a, and a large bank. That is a really different way of approaching this. It's not it's not academic only, it's not government only, it's commercial, government, academic, all coming together to try and work out what this future is going to look like. We saw Accenture um, come into South Australia at scale, 2,000 people, mainly focused on uh, AI, data analytics, um, cybersecurity, and a lot of their clients are outside of the state as well. So they're really coming here for that capability. This technology is going to be one of the key pillars that the future societies, future economies are built upon. Technology companies are great in that they're really looking at what's the world going to be like in 10 years time. So at the moment, we're not building so much the world for today, although we're getting many benefits out of that. We're really thinking, what, what does society, what does the economy look like in 10 years time? And let's build that. So for us, it is talking to companies around the world and, and asking them to come on that journey with us of building the future. So in the next 10, 20 years, you're, you're running entire systems off technology that's been built out of Adelaide.